Representation in TV has a long way to go, but things are definitely moving in the right direction. For one thing, the past few years have given us some pretty amazing LGBT couples to root for. From the couples who broke the mold to the ones who redefined how we tell love stories, we're recapping our top 10 gay TV couples. 10. Grizz and Sam, The Society Coming in at number 10 are Grizz and Sam from The Society. In a world with no more parents and no more rules, we got the chance to see these two find love and acceptance in each other. From their first conversation at their makeshift prom, we were rooting for them. Their chemistry was instant. It took Grizz a little liquid courage to approach his crush, but even his nerves were cute. After all, love gives you butterflies. Sam's hearing impairment could have caused problems for other couples, but never for him and Grizz. When Sam was worried about his speaking voice, Grizz was quick to crack a joke, putting him right at ease. He even learned sign language for him. Most teens don't even want to study for a Spanish final, but Grizz liked Sam so much he learned a whole language to impress him. And then there was the adorable way they finally got together. We'll never get over Grizz asking Sam how to sign Kiss Me. Seeing them separate at the end of the season broke our hearts and we're still bitter we didn't get a season two. We need to know if Sam kept his promise to come back to Grizz. 9. Adam and Eric – Sex Education Adam and Eric's relationship is a classic hate-to-love story, but Adam had to do some serious work to win Eric's heart. Eric regularly bullies Adam, but Adam's actions are all an attempt to push down his true feelings for Eric. After mistreating him for years because he was ashamed of his own sexuality, Adam finally works up the courage to kiss Eric in detention. But in season two, Adam is still not ready to make their relationship public. It takes Eric dating someone else for Adam to realize how much he cares about him. Determined to make things right, Adam barges into the school play, interrupting the performance to ask Eric to hold his hand. The public recognition of their relationship wins Eric over and he agrees to give Adam another chance. Eric's decision to forgive Adam caused some division among fans who thought his earlier mistakes were unforgivable but others thought the moment showed real growth for his character. Whichever side you fall on, you can't deny that the relationship got people talking. 8. Connor and Oliver – How to Get Away with Murder Luckily, we got to see our number 9 couple get their happy ending. Admittedly, their wedding was a little eventful. No one wants a murder on their big day. But the pair made it through all the show's twists and turns alive and together. Even though they made their relationship work, it wasn't always smooth sailing. Connor initially seduced Oliver to steal secrets for Annalise, but he caught feelings big time. And Oliver didn't just forgive him, he stood by him through everything. When Oliver helped to murder Sam, Connor didn't turn him in or judge him, he supported his boyfriend when he needed it most. Even though there were times when they were apart, these two always found their way back to each other no matter what life threw at them. Now that's love. 7. Lucas and Elliot – Scam France Lucas and Elliot added a whole new level of representation when they started an important conversation about mental health. The couple's relationship hits an early stumbling block when Lucas learns that Elliot is bipolar and worries that his feelings are just a product of his mania. Luckily, once Lucas learns more about bipolar disorder, he realizes that he was too quick to judge Elliot's feelings and he works on educating himself. The couple manages to work things out once they agree to take things day by day. Seeing them get their happy ending and challenge the stigma around mental health? We feel seriously blessed. 6. Mason and Corey, Teen Wolf Our next couple defied all the odds, even death. Teen Wolf is known for its supernaturally good romances, and Mason and Corey are no exception. When Corey struggles with his transformation into a chimera, it's Mason who keeps him connected to his human side and Mason clearly feels a strong connection to Corey. But their relationship almost didn't happen. Corey's untimely death put a definite pause on his attempts to win over Mason, but luckily he got a second chance when he was resurrected. And it was his feelings for Mason that ultimately pushed Corey to challenge and defeat his former alpha, Teo. And after things settled, the two kept fighting to keep the residents of Beacon Hills safe. Talk about a power couple! 5. Isaac and Evan Scam. Isaac and Evan are proof that true love isn't always easy, but when the couple meets, they're both in relationships with women and in denial of their feelings. But the more the two couples hang out, the closer the guys get, until one night they ditch their dates and share a romantic underwater kiss. But Isaac almost ruins things when he disses people with mental illness, not realizing that Evan is bipolar. 
Not to mention, Isaac is still struggling to accept his own sexuality and admit that he's gay. Luckily, Isaac's friends don't let him throw away a good thing, and they help Isaac to win back his man. Now those are the kinds of friends we want in our corner. 4. Ian and Mickey – Shameless Ian and Mickey's iconic relationship started when Mickey stole a gun – and Ian's heart. Even though their relationship started out as just a fling, it was clearly built to last. After all, it survived Mickey's two stints in juvie. But the couple faced an even bigger challenge. Mickey's homophobic dad caught them together and forced Mickey to marry a woman. Fortunately, the on-again, off-again couple found their way back to one another and eventually reunited in prison. Seeing them make it work against all odds was inspiring, and their banter always had us laughing or crying. And all their struggles were worth it because this last season gave them the happy ending they deserved. Despite Mickey initially getting cold feet, the couple made things official, getting married in a beautiful ceremony in front of their family and friends. Ian's dad Frank was cheering the loudest, and honestly, we felt the same way. 3. Omar and Ander – Elite Star-crossed lovers with disapproving parents? Omander is basically the Romeo and Juliet of Elite. Sparks immediately flew for the pair, but they had to keep their relationship a secret, especially because Omar was still trying to make sense of how his sexuality fit with his religious faith. And the pair had even bigger challenges to face when Ander found out he had cancer. Wanting to help Omar move on, Ander tried to push him away by pretending to have cheated. Not gonna lie, that moment had us in tears. Luckily, Omar kept fighting for his love, and he and Ander found their way back to each other. Ander kept fighting his cancer and eventually went into remission, giving these cuties a second chance. 2. Alex and Willie, Julie and the Phantoms Do you believe in life after love? We do, and it's all because of this supernaturally cute couple. You could say that the two ghosts literally fell for one another since they met when Reggie skated right into Alex. And their relationship is awesome because it's just a part of who the characters are. Their love story is front and center, but it's not super heavy or depressing. It's sweet and charming and totally adorable. We get to see the two going on museum dates and falling in love without making it some big, inaccessible thing. In a kid's show, this kind of representation is even more important. And even though both characters are dead, their relationship has some major stakes. Willie defied his evil ghost boss Caleb to save his BF, promising Alex that he'd do anything for him. And the actors might just be the couple's biggest stands. Boo Boo Stewart, who plays Willie, said he's rooting for the characters to have a full relationship in season 2. Fingers crossed that he gets his wish. 1. Alec and Magnus – Shadowhunters So which couple is number one on our list? Obviously, it's Malik. The stoic Shadowhunter and the charming warlock totally stole our hearts, and they didn't let go. When they first met, Magnus's undeniable charisma left Alec speechless. Luckily, he eventually figured out how to tell Magnus how he felt, and their relationship comes full circle in the series' final episode. Alec and Magnus share their first kiss when Magnus interrupts Alec's would-be wedding. It's big, romantic, and totally swoon-worthy, so it's only fitting that their love story ended with another wedding. Theirs Not gonna lie, we definitely shed a few happy tears when we saw Alec's mom walking Magnus down the aisle, showing that she totally supported the happy couple. The whole sequence was pure magic, and Magnus didn't even have to use his powers. Representation in TV has a long way to go, but these couples are proof that progress is happening. From mental illness to confronting their sexuality, these couples are redefining how we see love, and we are here for it. Not to mention, their sweet stories make us believe in love. What do you think? Did we miss anyone? And who's your favorite couple? Let us know in the comments below.